what's up here's part two of my video um i definitely got some real hot stuff to show y'all that i've just um brought so yeah let's get started um first thing i want to show you guys is my ascot um my dad made this ascot for me um what he did he took a tie that he really didn't want anymore it really was a very repetitive pattern you know wasn't anything that you know, we weren't, we were going to really wear as a neck tie, so he took this and instead of, you know, throwing the tie away, he cut it open in the back, which I'm going to make a video about that. He cut it open in the back and he did, um, he opened it up and he first wore it as an ascot. And I was like, hmm, I wonder how he did that. So, um... He wore it, and then after that, you know, I wore it, and folks was like, well, what is that? You know, you know, well, how did you do that? And I was like, all I did was, you know, take a necktie, cut it up in the back, open it up. And a lot of people are wearing, um, are trying to do the ascot look by taking a plain, regular, a, a regular necktie, and I just fold it over. Now, that's okay, but my only concern with that, that kind of style is, you, it doesn't really open up, and it really doesn't bloom out like... Um, like a regular ascot would, and it's hard to find ascots here, so we had to just do what we did and and make you know use what we had here because they were hard to find. So I will be coming with a tutorial on how to do it. So y'all uh, stay tuned and look out for that. Next thing I want to show y'all, um, the day after Christmas. I went and hit up K and G me um well fashion warehouse, big warehouse that sell a whole lot of um nice things, nice clothes. They have men and women clothes. And uh, they I uh, they have gotten a lot of new things in since the last time I've been there, which was the which had been August. So I was going through, you know, you know, just looking around and saw these bow ties. And I have been looking for some smaller classy bow ties you know because I heard a dude in um on a video on YouTube he was talking about church fashion do's and don'ts he was saying that bow ties aren't meant to be you know the big ones with the rhinestones all of them which they are nice but uh, he said bow ties are meant to be you know small and classy so I, I went to the store and I was like I've been trying to look for some small bow ties because I went to S&K but they had them, theirs were half price, but, you know, you had to tie them, and they were the hardest thing for me to try to tie, and the man was trying to show me how to do it, and it was just like math. It was it was just like, I, I didn't get it, I didn't understand it, so I uh, went and I said, I'm going to pick up these bow ties, and they are just nice, and they're just perfect. So I brought brown, gold, and I brought um, blue, and... I'll probably wear them, you know, to just give me that preppy look, like, you know, the schoolboy look. Real, real nice look. Um, I've worn the brown one twice in one of my other videos. You see me wearing the brown one. And I'm not really, I'm wearing it, but I'm not really wearing it to my full potential. So, yeah, y'all um, look out for, um, y'all go and look at that just to see how it looks. But I definitely will be posting pictures on, um these bow ties with other outfits that I've came up with to go to coordinate. The um, last thing that I want to show you guys was um, this. I, um, the same day I brought those bow ties, I brought this. I actually brought two. I brought one that was in white that had like the um, black and gray paisley on it. And I haven't, I'm, for the life of me, I haven't figured out how to really um, tie it yet. We tried to do a necktie, but all it did was fall. So, we're still trying to look for um, options to um, to try to figure out, you know, what to do about how to, you know, how to tie these. So, um, as soon as I figure out what, you know, what I decide to do with this, I definitely will be coming with a video on what I did. So y'all just keep it locked and, um, find out how I made it, um, happen. But anyway, they were really, uh, unique. And I said, there's many possibilities with this, but 
the secret is all in the safety pin. So if we can just at least figure out, you know, how to um, uh, go about you know, tying them around our neck to try to get the the look. I don't know if it's supposed to be an ascot. I'm thinking it's an ascot. So I'm definitely gonna play with it and play with it. And then as soon as I find an answer, um, I'm definitely gonna post something for y'all. And um, just a few tips uh, of my own that really helps me. Um, I've been, you know, I'm still learning a lot of stuff about, you know, the fashion and things and stuff. So I, I'm, I'm kind of learning to be versatile. Um, I don't want to just be the preppy look, and I just, and I don't just want like the bishop look. <clears throat> I kind of want to mix you know all three looks because you know some Sundays I wake up and I, I don't know why I don't know if I'm the only one that does this but I wake up and I don't really feel like getting dressed up today so I might just want to throw on you know a nice blazer sweater maybe a um, you know a real you know a solid tie shirt some slacks and call it a Sunday but then there might be Sundays where I'm like I'm, I'm getting dressed tomorrow I'm getting dressed so I might decide that, yeah, I want to throw on my three-piece suit, you know, with the uh, kick pleat in the back and with um, with my, you know, they got the the triple-breasted vest in the middle. I might decide I want to do that. And there's other things I might decide, well, you know, I want to really, really just get my preppy look on. I want to rock a cardigan and a blazer and a real nice, small, classy bow tie. I just want to look classy. Then there's other times I'm like, I, I just want to look conservative. Today. I want to look like, just like I'm going to the office. Some Sundays I just wake up like that. I don't know what it is, but y'all pray. <laughs> and um, definitely I will be coming with um, coming with some more stuff. I st I'm still learning a lot of stuff. I'm still real nervous. Um, if you hear anything in the background, see some lights go off in the background. It was my parents. I was trying to tell them to be as quiet as possible, but... You know, so y'all yeah, definitely um, subscribe, message me, um, any kind of constructive criticism. That's always welcome. Cause I know it's a lot of things that I could do better to make these videos better. But y'all definitely comment. Y'all send me friends requests, subscribe. You know, just do do it. Just do it. Um, so I'll see you guys. Um, the weekend oh don't forget about the inauguration on tuesday i will be watching that um so y'all just look out for me and i'll see y'all next time thanks